Today I'm going to talk about how you would import a movie file and convert it into frames. If I, in this example, I'm finding that I shot a video and I actually need some stills to go along with it. So I'm just going to go to Photoshop, File, Import, Video Frames to Layers. You can also import directly from a device. And I select Movie. That's my movie file open. And I can do from beginning to end, I can do a selected range, selecting an in and out. Or I can do beginning to end, and either way I can select the number of frames in between each still. So for example, I'm just going to pick 10. If I had done, if it was a longer video and I just picked one or two, sometimes you're just going to end up with a huge file and you're not going to really need all those frames. So I'm going to go with 10 for now. Okay. And you can see that all these, all these layers have been imported as stills. So then I just go through, select what I need. And then once you're done selecting the ones you need, but you may want to delete some, you just go file, export layers to files. So I'm just going to browse my destination open and I can give it, assign it a prefix. So I'll just say, um, And you can include visible layers only. So if I didn't want to export all these, visible layers only. My file type, I'm just going to do JPEG. I can increase my quality and then run it. And I'll just run it for an example. So we'll see how long that takes. The last time I did this, it only took a couple minutes, but you can see it populating my folder back here with my prefix and the layer number. And my layer number suffix. Export layer successful, then I, I'm just going to view, I'm going to pull it into bridge and just view but that's pretty much it, how you would export an mp4 or movie file into Photoshop and create stills. Hope this is helpful. Please subscribe, give me a thumbs up. Thank you for watching.